I'm Nancy E.T. Johnson, mathematics teacher. This is how to find volume in cubic feet. A cubic foot is a cube whose dimensions are one foot in width, one foot in height, and one foot in depth. So if these measurements were in feet, this would represent a cubic foot. It's actually smaller. We have the width of this box is about 15 inches. Its depth is about 12 inches. And the height is 10 inches. So we have 15, 10, and 12. Since these are in inches and we want our calculation to be in cubic feet, we need to change these to feet before we multiply. 15 inches is a one foot and then three twelfths of an inch. So one and three twelfths feet. 10 inches is 10 twelfths of a foot. We could simplify that to five sixths of a foot. And 12 inches is exactly one foot. When we're calculating the volume of a uh, rectangular prism like this, we multiply width times height times depth. The three measurements. So to find the volume of this object, we would need to multiply 1 and 3 twelfths times 5 sixths times 1. If I change this, um, in, this uh, mixed number to back to um, 15 twelfths, it will make it easier to multiply. And when you multiply times 1, we get the same number. So 15 times 5 is 75. And 12 times 6 gives us 72. So it looks like we have 72 over 72 would be 1. 1 and 3 over 72 cubic feet. Since we were multiplying feet times feet times feet, that's where we're getting the feet to the third power, read as cubic feet. That's how to find volume in cubic feet. I'm Nancy E.T. Johnson, mathematics teacher.